Welcome to Pelican's Perch, located at 328 East Sunset Avenue. That's Pensacola, Florida, 32507 if you want to look at it on Google Maps. As you can see down the dock, let me zoom in a little bit, there's a couple of ducks sitting underneath the chair right there. And here we are coming into the house. You have ample driveway for four to six cars to be parked. Manicured lawn. And this is the front door. Many of our guests say this is their favorite spot. They sit at this, these little lounge chairs, these little lounge chairs and lounge and drink their morning coffee and watch the porpoises that do come in from time to time out in the bayou out there. As you can see up above it says 32080 sunset. Now let's go inside. As you walk in, you'll see the large eat-in kitchen with seating for 17 people with a fireplace to the left. All newly remodeled in 2013 with granite countertops, side-by-side -side refrigerator, stainless steel appliances, even have a TV for the cook so the cook can Keep up with the games or the news or whatever is going on. Walk down this first hallway to the east end of the house. You have a queen bed. And then to the left right here is the bath at this end, the second bath at this end of the house. Out here is the game room which we converted the garage into a game room you can see a full-size air hockey brand new ping pong table and then we do have a washer dryer brand new washer dryer for our guest convenience and some fishing poles for the kids or whoever want to go over and take a shot at catching a spotted sea trout. They're out there right now with some live bait. As we walk out through the kitchen to the back, we have a back porch, very comfortable for lounging in. It's covered and screened. And then Here's the grill outside on the deck. It's a really nice Weber grill with a canopy over the top. And then of course you've got a gazebo covering up a couple of other tables. Seating for plenty of people out here. Here's another table and chairs. And a really nice spacious backyard. There's our wood pile for the fireplace. That's an avocado tree that's just getting going. And that's a future building out there. And that's the garbage can area there. We just walk out on the deck to take the garbage out so you don't have to leave the... You don't have to put your shoes on to take the garbage out. Go back inside. Of course, there's your dishwasher. As we walk down the hallway, Towards the west end of the building, you'll see the first bedroom off to the right, which is what we call bedroom number three. It's a queen size, has its own dresser, nightstand, and then a TV dresser that we will be putting a TV on. Directly across the hall from that is the TV room. 
That's a 55 inch 3D TV with 3D glasses. It's got Blu-ray hooked up to it. It's a smart TV, so it's hooked up to the internet. It's a little hard to see with the glare, but that's your view out looking out to the bayou. It's called Davenport Bayou. We have a lounge chair for the head man himself, I guess. <laughs> and then we have two very comfortable couches. And then behind me are some bean bags for the kids to throw down on the ground and get comfortable watching a, a video on the big 3D TV. So we walk back down the hallway. Here's the second or the first bathroom. This is an older style house, so it does not have a master suite. The bathroom is in the hallway, which is shared for everyone. As you go into the second bedroom, this is what we call the kids' room. We have it set up with a bunk bed, which is a twin on the top, or a twin on the bottom, I'm sorry. Or double on the bottom and a twin on the top. And then we also have a blow-up air mattress that could be utilized in here with, obviously, sheets and everything. Um, it could be used in here or it could be used in the TV room. And then we walk across the hall. This would be the master bedroom. It has its own TV, as you can see, and a really nice view of the bayou. It's just really hard to get a good picture of it with the glare of the sun. But me looking at it looks great. And you've got big closets. And then there's your king size master bedroom with a desk. If you bring your computer, do a little work from while you're on your vacation, or just watch Keeping Up with Your Favorite Sports Team. And back in the kids' room, we do have a pack-and-play crib and also a high chair that is available. Sorry, that was the closet in the kids' room. Walk back into the master and open up the left side of the closet. And we have a high chair and a pack and play crib that's available if you bring some little ones with you.